The Japanese Chin, also known as a Japanese Spaniel, is a rare toy breed with a noble and ancient heritage. Before becoming popular in Japan, the breed was thought to be originated in China. The Japanese Chin is a charming little companion with a silky, profuse coat and elegant attitude. This lapdog is fastidious, elegant, and quiet, and is regarded as a really feline breed. Today in this video, we will discuss about the Japanese Chin, the cat-like Japanese dog. Let's jump on it! History The Japanese Chin is an ancient toy breed that originated from the Tibetan Spaniel. Dogs like the Chin have been seen on ancient ceramics in ancient Chinese temples. The dogs are believed to have originated in China. The first European records of the Chin date back to the 1600s, when Portuguese sailors presented Chins as a gift to Princess Catherine of Braganza. World War I and earthquakes in Japan decreased the number of Chin. The AKC recognized them as the Japanese Chin in 1977. Appearance the Japanese Chin has a bright and intelligent look, and an oriental expression. These dogs have a huge broad head, large wide-set eyes, a short broad mouth, ear feathering and uniform facial markings define its distinctive expression. The Japanese Chin is known for its calm demeanor, loyalty, and affection. It is described as a cat-like dog that enjoys cuddling up on its owner's lap. While it might be reserved around people and pets, it is a very social and loving friend. Behavior a Japanese Chin is a dog that follows its owner about while goes about daily tasks. These dogs have a sweet nature, makes it a great choice for a family to look for a lap dog. Its curiosity is almost cat-like. In reality, cats and Japanese Chins share many characteristics. Another thing that sets from cats is that they groom themselves by licking their paws and rubbing their faces. This dog is ideal for households with older children. These little dogs are wary of strangers and will normally alarm the home if someone comes to the door. Health Luxating patellas, cataracts, and early-onset heart murmurs are all common health conditions in the Japanese chin. The chin is at risk of hypoglycemia when under 6 months old or weighing 4 to 5 pounds. Seasonal allergies affect some Japanese chin. The Japanese chin's flattened branches phallic face might cause breathing and vision problems. Its big eyes are readily damaged, resulting in corneal scratches or more serious ulcerations. Grooming They are usually white with black patches, but they also have orange, sable, and brindle patches. The Japanese chin grooms itself by licking its paws like a cat. To keep the Japanese chin's long coat tangle-free, brush it twice or three times per week. Bathe them once a month with a gentle wash and towel dry before brushing them to keep their coat healthy. Training Needs Japanese chins are quite simple to train. Please keep in mind that they are sensitive pets. As a result, using a harsh voice during teaching will be ineffective. A soothing voice, cookies, and words of praise work well for this lapdog. Though these dogs might be stubborn, they are very intelligent and can learn obedience lessons quickly. Is Japanese chin the right dog for you? The Japanese chin is a loving dog. He is not suggested for families with small children. A noisy child might easily injure him. The breed gets along nicely with older children who know how to properly handle a dog. The Japanese Chin is a beautiful little companion who is loyal and helpful to its owner. Japanese Chins are companion dogs who thrive when they're with the people they care for. These dogs make good pets in almost any living space. This Tibetan Spaniel descendant is good with older children. Smaller kids are more likely to make a Japanese Chin frightened about being injured by accident. If I missed any information, let me know by commenting below. Thanks for watching this video. You are invited to watch more videos and subscribe our channel for more updates. Thank you.